Hey everyone, this is Ben with Tech Summa Homes. Welcome back and thank you for joining us. Today I have a special treat for you. This is the Solitaire PRT4 Super Closet. So there's a few different variations of this house, but this one's gonna have the four bedrooms, three complete bathrooms with a super closet. And we'll show you what that means here in a little bit. This house is gonna be 32 foot wide, 82 foot long. So we're coming in at 2,624 square foot. This is a massive house. So let's just get straight into it. I know you're excited to see it, come on. All right, everyone, starting on the outside of the PRT4 Super Closet, see this house is set up with lap siding. So instead of having your normal um, smart panel siding like the HD and the uh, FP150 over there, you're gonna have the lap siding. So still LP smart panel, it's just gonna be lap versus the um, vertical. You can see we have the gypsum color with the uh, black magic trim. This house does have the Imperial package standard, and we also ordered this with platinum package. That means it will have a layer of plywood behind the uh, siding. So pardon the road noise. With this solitaire home, we're gonna have the decorative front door. Without uh, the platinum package, this will actually have a storm door on the front of it. Notice we have our nice big 12 inch eave all the way around. It's gonna allow ventilation of the um, hot air and cool air in the attic. This house is powered with a attic ventilator fan so you can exchange the air in the attic space. This house has the low E thermal windows. Um, we also upgraded the insulation in the floor and in the roof. So this one does qualify for Energy Star. It's gonna be the vent for the fireplace that's inside the home and we'll show you that here in a second. Now we have a few options um, on your Imperial package. You're gonna get these um, lights standard on the corners, and then you can also do the four corner lights as well if you wanted to add them on there. So that means you're gonna have a total of eight separate lights on the corner of the house, or you know, total in the corners of the house. So normally I, I can show you this vent system, but right behind this plastic, there is two attic vents. There's gonna be two on the other side as well paired with the e-vents that I spoke about earlier and the power attic, power attic ventilator fan that's gonna be able to exchange that air that I was talking about. We're looking at the solitaire frame. We have a full length outrigger, so that means that this piece of metal here is gonna go all the way to the sidewall. Now, what, this house is a 32 wide, so that each half is 16 feet. Getting back into the frame, we have our Z channel. So this is the cross member that uh, holds the two I-beams together. If we can get down here, you can see it goes all the way down. Most houses are gonna have a C-channel, so this piece is like this. This is mainly for shipping structure. So as the house and the truck jar back and forth, this is gonna be able to put resistance both ways. It's gonna allow less cracking, or not allow as much cracking in the walls. This house is overbuilt anyway, so we typically don't see a lot of sheetrock damage. All right, so coming on this side. So we can see on this house, we did not do the four corner security lights. All right, so as we come around, we're gonna see we have the fresh water connection. So coming down below, see we have our fresh water coming in, PEX, and then right over here, right above it, you're gonna see we have an electrical receptacle. So this is so that you can plug in a heat strip and protect your pipes in the winter months. Dryer vent right there. On this house, we added the option of putting a rear steel door that opens inward and you'll have a storm door on this. So standard, it'll be an outward opening door. You do have your security light above or your uh, light out of the door, porch light. It's your water heater access panel right there. This is gonna be your drains below. And then right here, this is gonna be where your electrical connection comes into the house. So your uh, electrician will fish the wire up through there, connect into the breaker box gonna be your microwave vent hood vent microwave vent hood vent something nice that solitaire does is you can see we have marked a drain outlet so the drain outlet right there in the middle of the screen so solitaire is gonna have a drain outlet per side already pre plumbed underneath the underbelly so you're not gonna to have to worry about adding a whole bunch of extra piping under the house just plop right into that one connect it to the other half and right to the septic or sewage 
an exterior electrical receptacle. It is protected. So that's going to be on the outside of your solitaire. Um, something that you're going to get in the platinum package is going to be the 30 year architectural shingles up top. So it's something I can't get a good spot over there. It's going downhill. So let's go on the inside, take a look what it looks like. As we walk up to the front door, you're gonna see we have this recessed entry. We have the outdoor carpet. If you look, it's kind of hard to see. Right here in the corner, you can see we have a metal pan that's gonna go up behind the smart panel. So it's actually gonna come up about this high. That way, any, and it's sloped backwards, that way any water will roll off and not rot out that floor. All right. So here we go. 32 wide and it shines in this 2,624 square foot home. So let's take a quick look, or actually a really nice look at this living room. It's huge. You can see above we have the tray ceiling. This house also has upflow air. Once we get to these upgraded packages, you're gonna get the thicker crown molding above your base trim below, upgrading to the 40 ounce carpet, ceiling fans gonna come standard in this home. And on this one, we have a wood burning fireplace. Also have an option to make this brick all the way up. The house in this one, we did paint ashen. So nice tan color, looks really good with grays or browns. One thing we really like about the solitaire home is this Four window with the four transom windows above lets in tons of natural light. We've also added your recessed can lighting in your living room. It's gonna cross over into your dining room and it's also in the kitchen. So here's your dining room. Pretty good size. We do have another option to where you can put sliding glass door right there. So if you like the windows and you don't like sliding glass doors, don't worry about it. But if you would like another um, entrance or exit into the home, sliding glass doors here. So you get your two shots over here. So this is gonna be a little built-in desk right off the dining room kitchen. And then this is gonna lead right into your kitchen, which comes from your living room. So let me go ahead and get over here and get you a good look. Really, really nice home. The 32 wide definitely helps it out as far as space. So coming right over here in the kitchen, you can see we have a huge amount of cabinet storage, stainless steel appliances. If you notice, look how deep these ones are here. Salter is gonna have all real wood cabinets you're gonna have your, your backer, so you're not gonna have the painted wall. And you're also gonna have, um, not, in the, not in these ones, but in the main ones over here, adjustable shelving. Let me show you what those look like. So you get your nice adjustable shelving in there as well. Also have your hidden hinges. This is the golden oak coloring. Now, this is an older style um, solitaire, and, and when I say that, I mean, we do have some new countertops and other options available. Be sure to look out on the channel to see that. That'll be probably one of the next videos. But we now have white cabinets available. We can do the titanium, which was traditionally in the single wides only. And we can also keep it with the natural. So the golden oak, um, until they run out, may not be available here soon. So we got the nice step up island. Coming up over here, we see we have plenty of electrical receptacles, and two right there four drawer bank, some more storage. We'll get to the pantry here in a second. So huge windows, or a huge window, and the, the, the two side ones open up right here, let in some air. In the platinum package, which this one has, you're gonna get the microwave vent a hood. Stainless steel uh, stove on this house, and that's gonna come standard with your stainless steel package. So it's called black stainless, more of like a charcoal or graphite. 
Also, very big news. If you like the dual sinks, here you go. If you want, we can do a farmhouse sink now. So single basin farmhouse sink. This home, once we go to the platinum package, you're gonna have upgraded mowing faucets. Okay, let's head over to this pantry. A lot of people like a large pantry and this is something in this house I really think is awesome. Especially since it has so much cabinet storage, you're gonna have a really nice big pantry. And the nice thing with the solitaire, they're not putting in your uh, wire racking in there. And they're even finishing out this pantry with the trim above and the base trim below. So this is gonna be um, ind individually laid vinyl tile on the floor. The tile 16 by 16 squares are no longer gonna be available. So it's just gonna be either this wood look or, um, actually this one's gonna be discontinued. It'll be a little bit lighter and a little bit darker version. And now we can do flooring in the living room and in the bedrooms. So something that's never been able to be done before, solitaire double wides, we can now do flooring, plank flooring throughout. This is gonna be an amazing option. We're so excited. Coupled with the white cabinet and some of the new decor, I think you guys are gonna be very excited. All right, let's head over to the utility room. Oh, also real quick, this is also an option that we've added on there. Give me your wood beam with the pendant lighting. Just gives it a really nice look and has some globes that'll, or little, you know, globes that'll come down. Also wanted to show you the recessed can lighting in the kitchen. You got another one right over there. All right, so from the kitchen, saloon doors are going away, guys. So everyone that gives me grief about them, one last time. Going through our saloon doors into the um, utility room. As you can see, we here, let me open this up for some light. Stand by. There we go. All right, so we have a spot for your wash machine and dryer. So we have your vent and then your plug-in. This is a service panel to get into your water connections. Right here, we have your water shut off. This is the whole house water shut off. And then you have your um, whole house ventilation. So this is gonna be the ventilation panel I was talking about outside. This would be something you do at the end of a hot day. Turn that on, it's gonna exchange that hot air out of the attic space, helping keep it cool. Here's gonna be your plug for your uh, washing machine. Now this option we added here is gonna be your sink with overhead cabinets. The nice thing about this sink is that it is very deep. If you do not want this, then it would just be an open area for like a refrigerator. You're still gonna get the plug. The only difference would be you can put a, um, I think you can put another hall tree or like a mud bench in here if you wanted. This house is really big being 2,624 square feet as mentioned earlier. So it's gonna have two furnaces. They're both gonna be located right here in the utility room. Below is gonna be where you'll be able to change your um, air filter for manufacturer specs. Right over here is gonna be your um, electrical panel. This house was selected as um, Energy Star certified. If you upgrade the insulation, that's something you can do. You have to do upflow air and you have to um, upgrade your insulation to R40 in the roof, R22 in the floor and R19 in the sidewall. I'm showing you this here. This is where your water heater is. So this is something where we tell our new customers, make sure you do not turn this on until the water heater is full, it will burn out the element and then no hot water. All right. With the platinum package that this one has, you do get the upgraded six panel doors with the lever handles. Standard, this is gonna have a flat door with a knob handle. So just a little bit of an upgrade there. We're gonna get into another video talking about the platinum and, and, and Imperial and some of the changes Solitaire's made in those packages. Hey everyone, if you're enjoying the home tour, make sure you hit the like button. Also subscribe so you can see more houses that are coming to you. We have more solitaire homes coming and a big sneak peek that I'm telling you right now. We do, and I'll flash it right here on the screen. We have a whole brand new decor on the solitaire line, which a lot of you guys have been bringing it up. We've been listening. We've been taking all the comments below, all the negative and all the positives that we've been hearing. And we finally got some changes done. So we're going to show you a little sneak peek of the decor right over here. You're not going to want to miss it. So come on, let's finish up this home tour. Okay, here we go. So we're walking into the master bedroom. This thing is massive. Massive bedroom. Ceiling fan above is standard. Let me get over here. So you can see. Let 
Not only does this have a massive master bedroom, it's gonna have a super closet. So this is the PRT4 super closet. So as we walk in, um, don't mind all the mess. This is all the materials that are gonna be needed to put the home together later. So let's start over here and get you a good, good look at this. So plenty of hanging storage there. Built-in little mirror shelving. Plenty of drawers over there. You have this really nice island with drawers and cabinets. Pretty much you don't need any furniture in the room besides your bed or any type of seating. Nice built-in shelf. More hanging storage. You got pants, skirt storage down here. Two big windows are leaving you a ton of natural light. Right behind these, uh, here, let me move this out of the way so you can see it. Nice bench with storage. I'm gonna put these back so they don't get damaged. One second, okay. Continuing with your storage over there, your hanging storage anyway. If you did not want the super closet, basically the closet would be cut off right about, you know, right about here, still pretty good size. And this would be another, this would be an open wall in a seating area. That's the PRT4. And that's gonna be the um, parent retreat. Anyways, massive super closet. After looking at all that greatness, we're gonna come into a very nice bathroom as well. So we have the double entry French doors, or French doors anyway. We can do the solid like this, or we can do a glass insert, which looks really nice. All right, so coming into the master bedroom, we have his and hers. So this is what I would consider her side, but I'll, I'll let you guys decide what you wanna do there. You have the two mirrors, medicine cabinet, sink, cabinet storage, and four drawer bank. Nice little vanity for a seat, getting ready. A little bit of linen storage right here to the left. Nice thing in here is look at tons of light. So you have two, four, big light in the middle. And then we're coming over to the other side, which is medicine cabinet, mirror, four drawer bank as well. Cabinet storage, porcelain sink. These are all porcelain sinks. Like I said, upgraded Moen faucets. Now we're looking at the drop-in tub. You can get this in a jet tub as well. So if you wanted the uh, Whirlpool jets in there, they can add those. Very comfortable tub. Little linen storage, little knickknacks. Tons of natural light in this house, y'all. Here we go, we have our huge 60 inch shower. Also have our little bench back there. Something that's a really nice feature is a separate toilet with its own room. So toilet, got some storage above, even has its own window and ventilation pan. Right over here, you're gonna, you're gonna see we have water shutoffs. So once we get to the platinum package, which will now be separate options, you're gonna get water shutoffs at your toilets, all your sinks, at your kitchen and your bathrooms. So it's a really nice feature to be able to isolate in case of a leak or repairs or upgrades. So this is just the first half of the PRT4. Now we're gonna get into the guest side. Nice thing about this home, it is four bedroom, three bath, okay? Before we get into that, I did wanna show you this opening here. So, you know, I get a lot of people asking, you know, what's it supposed to be? When this house is delivered, they're gonna float the ceiling over and this is gonna be a nice beam the reason why this is gonna be a beam in the middle, so this is gonna be a beam in the middle of your room. This will be an, a way to walk around. They leave that opening so that the house still has that full open feel. When it's finished out, hopefully I can get a photo of it. When it's finished out, it looks very nice and you won't even notice it. But it does, that little bit of opening here and here really does open it up. I've had a customer that did close it in, it's fine and it looks okay. It just really makes this room seem slightly smaller. Just that little, little detail. Okay, let's get into the guest side. All right, so as we're heading to the guest side, we have our first full bathroom right here. Get a good look at it, we'll walk in. So all the way in the back, you're gonna see we have a tub shower combo, one piece fiberglass. You have your uh, toilet, there's a long gated commode, so this is an upgrade as well. This house does come with a um, skylight to allow a lot of natural light in here. 
This is optional, so if you didn't want it, we could take it off, but um, it, does, it does give it a good look. All right, so we have some cabinet storage with a porcelain sink, big old mirror, and then some linen storage as well. So this is a really nice house that has three bathrooms, full bathrooms. So once we leave the middle bathroom, before we get to the bedrooms, you can see we have this awesome student center. So anyone that works from home or homeschools, this is a dream to have. So you have plenty of seating for more than one person, obviously. A lot of shelving and a lot of built-ins. So if this is something that you think you can utilize, let us know. If you did not need this area, then we can turn this four bedroom into a three bedroom. So this is a bedroom right here where we eliminate this wall and the, all the built-ins in this wall. And then this will be a massive second living room. But this one has the four bedrooms, so we're just gonna talk about this one here. So coming into the four bedrooms, we did order the ceiling fans in this house. The nice thing about getting to the 32 wide is your guest bedrooms are gonna be huge. So this is the smallest of the guest bedrooms and it's pretty massive. One thing I really love in this house as well is that we're getting walk-in closets in all the guest bedrooms. As you notice, this house is fully tape and textured, meaning that it has sheet rock walls everywhere. They're textured and painted. Some manufactured homes are gonna give you, um, you know, the board and bat strips in your closets or in your, in your utility room, but this house is fully tape and textured, giving you more of a residential feel and look. Coming into the Jack and Jill third full bathroom. So you can see we have our sink, four drawer bank and cabinet storage. We have our elongated commode toilet and another tub shower full fiberglass combination. As I was mentioning earlier, this is going to be no this is no longer going to be available in the solitaire homes. We're going to the plank look. It is vinyl tile plank, so it's it's not um, linoleum. So this is really where you're going to see a huge difference in the 32 wide in this house. Look how big this room is. I mean, that's one thing with the customers. Like this room is bigger than most double wide master bedrooms because it's a 32 wide. This is 16 foot from here. Well, minus the eave. So you got 15 foot interior. It's big. Again, a lot of natural light. Order the ceiling fans and then we're going to have another walk-in closet. Now this other room is going to be a duplicate mirror of this house except for the... Um, window is moved just because it's on the front side so we can get the front side look as well. Now one thing I didn't touch on which I should have brought up earlier is all of our solitaire homes are going to come with 2x6 floor joists and on top of that we're going to have the solitaire bridge design which is a 2x3 pattern on top of all the floor joists and the plywoods on top of that. So plywood floor with the solitaire bridge design pattern. This is one of the strongest floors in the industry. And if you notice, as I was looking around, we have minimal cracks. You're gonna see one or two, you know, above doorways, you know, as you can see there, maybe even um, in the bathroom, or sorry, in the bedrooms, like above the windows. But it is not like some of these other houses that we get shipped from even local. This one came all the way from Deming, New Mexico. So it's a, it's, it is a big deal. One thing I wanted to show you about the floor and this is really hard to tell in a video, but I mean, this thing is solid. You know, as I walk around through here, you're not getting that hollow manufactured home feel. This is a solid floor and you don't feel the bowing under your feet because it's not. It is solid. Hey everyone, there we have it. That is the Solitaire PRT4 Super Closet. So massive house. If you have a large family or just need the space, this is a really good home to be able to utilize the four bedrooms and the three full bathrooms. The student center is a plus, but if that's not something you need, we do have some variations available. And if you don't need that super closet and you want a little bit more modest closet and get you a bigger bedroom, we can do that. So just message us below. We'll show you what those floor plans are. Guys, you're not going to want to miss what's coming. We have some new solitaire houses coming. We have some new decor. So go and click right here for some more solitaire videos. Just go and click right here if you just want to see the awesome next video coming up. We'll see you in the next one, y'all.